what all did you do to build your CV? So if suppose I am a, uh, after seeing this webinar, I'm interested to uh, give USMLE, what all should I do in order to make my CV stronger and uh, CV more attractive so that I'll get better opportunities in the US? Starting yeah. from day one. Today. Uh, so regarding CV, it's actually a bit tricky uh, because uh, CV comes in a different way. Like uh, what what happened with me was I hadn't made my mind like whether to go for uh, USMLE or not during my medical school days. So what I did was I only fixed my mind after my internship. But somewhat lucky for me, I had been actively involved in all the events that has been happening in the college. Actually, and uh, luckily, I had some things in my uh, account. So like I was organizer for the my events in college because i wanted to do something in college i want I, I like i'm a person like who is who gets bored sitting idle so i did something so ultimately it worked out but for person people who have made up their mind in their med school itself i would highly recommend them to build a cv like there are different ways of building a cv for example like uh if it, it's not necessary that you will have to do what the other person has if you look at another person's cv it's not necessary that you should have those same like uh for example if you are in first year or second year you can volunteer for the icm or sts so that you can have an exposure and you can get involved in research projects and definitely you can go for a volunteering like in her by in form of health camps uh, blood donation campaigns and uh, immune awareness programs all these things actually like they do really count and you can do uh, what to say there are like there are a lot of op uh, opportunities that you can do uh, you have to improve your cv so cv as such uh, i guess that yeah like i said it, it, it will depend from uh, what what the person actually wants in a CV. And for example, like if you're matching into a highly uh, competitive program like orthopedics or dermatology, you will need CV somewhere in your CV. So like it's it's highly advisable to start with some projects from earlier on in the med school itself. And finding a good mentor, all this actually matters.